This is the play wall from uh, Barco. It's uh, an interactive uh, display. We make it interactive because it has smart sensors. So there's a gesture camera, which you see beneath. There's a webcam, which is actually measuring the interactivity. There's a Wi-Fi connection, so I can change the content from my smartphone. <coughs> there's also a sound, and the sound will only play when you're interacting with the display, which makes it rather cool. So if you're walking by, it grabs your attention. It's actually very easy to set up because you're just using two layers. One is an image and a video, or two images or two videos. So this effect with the Muppets makes it you know, like a reveal effect. <clears throat> if you come by, when Miss Piggy is there, she will make sound. And that's because now I'm interacting. When I'm not interacting, there will be no sound. So let's go to the next one, because Disney is using this rather regularly for their uh, studio content. So if there is a release like Frozen, what you see here is the kids, they can swipe away the ice. And they can see the crazy characters at the back end. So this was a huge success in uh, Germany. And it's actually very simple to set up. You just use your existing media. So there's a background, which is the video. And there's a foreground, which is one image. I'll show you more content. This is Popcorn, which was a success at CinemaCon. Because the kids kept on playing with it. So you just pass by. You can play with a bucket here. And if you fill it, you will get a reward. So that's our idea of making this display work for the cinema business. You can either use it for concessions, advertising, or selling movie tickets. That's what this is about. So I will show you one last one. This one is for the ladies. So, hold on. So you can also use it for advertising. This is again just one image. When the lady walks by, this is what happens. So, thank you very much.